Slave hunters. They're done for. Yes. Get them. Take them all down. Kill them all. <laughs> all right. We are back in Kenshi with Asagami and his team. Now, when we last left the team, man, we had a bit of an episode. <laughs> We, we intended to take a short trip out to hang. You can see it from here. Should have been nice and easy just to do some shopping. But on the way out, uh, we stumbled upon a camp that belonged to the free traders. It seemed like there were some empire peasants roaming around in there as well. We went to stop and talk to the free traders and it seemed like they did not care for us too much because we have prosthetic limbs and maybe also because we have a metal man with us. And they threatened us and they said, uh, get out or we'll attack. And so we got out and they attacked anyway. But it was a bit of a mess because we were somewhat surrounded. It was a little chaotic in there and a bunch of people fell. It was a bit disastrous. We limped back with as many people as we could, but Azagami, Naganuma, and Teaspoon were stuck out in the desert when they finally got themselves together and were able to attempt to limp back to the base. They ran into some slave hunters who were so poorly outfitted and had such low skills that I thought nothing of it. We figured we'd teach at least one of them a lesson, who proceeded to knock all three characters out immediately <laughs> and enslave them. So we took everybody out. We took the whole base out to save them. And now our ex-slaves for 79 hours, uh, Naganuma, Azagami, and Teaspoon, unfortunately. So somewhat unfortunately, I guess I will say, is um, the character that we captured, the leader of the free traders, has disappeared. Now, they could have just escaped. However, it also could be because I have had to import my save. And yeah, man, I've got fingers crossed. I'm really hoping for the best here. It seems like there was a Steam update within the last week, and every game I have launched has had a special Steam pop-up that says I need to update the game before I can play. And then I have to acknowledge that a bunch of times while it updates. Though there is no update to any of these games. I'm guessing it's like a caching issue. Maybe they updated something with the UI and cleared out my cache. So that uninstalled all of my mods, uh, or at least they didn't register when I tried to launch the game. So that was a big mess. Uh, I figured out how to get them working again without having to actually reinstall them. Uh, but then everything was just messed up. So I had to uh, import the save, which it seems like, which I will say is uh, majorly, unfortunately, uh, we've lost our Traders Guild friends, uh, I guess forever. Oh, well. If you are just tuning into this series, we had a uh, Traders Guild who did not want to leave, and so we made them a little honorary shop out here, and they just kind of parked out here and they would not move. Um, but it was great because their inventory kept resetting, and they had a ton of money and they had a ton of gear, so it's kind of setting the, uh, the base on easy mode. But they're gone, and it does indeed seem like the uh, person whom we were going to take out our frustrations on uh, has disappeared, so... Yeah, they're nowhere to be found. All right, well, that is what it is. Uh, we're gonna hope for the best for the rest of the save file. It doesn't seem like anything else was too messed up. Everything seems like it's in its place. And before I started recording, I've gone ahead and gotten everybody uh, healed and ready to rock and roll, except for I think I do need to take... Yeah, Azagami, Naganuma, and Teaspoon are gonna have to get inside one of these buildings and grab some shoes, because they all ran out of shoes. We'll let them start that. But then while that was happening, also, uh, we finally have a surplus of chew sticks. Uh, looks like our cactus farm is finally producing, and we got somebody working on, I think we got... Dima? Dima, yeah. Dima's working on uh, cooking all the meat we picked up uh, whilst fighting in the last episode. We also are in the middle of expanding our wheat farm to an extra large wheat farm uh, because we have... Where's Valerie? Valerie, where are you running to? It seems like we finally have a surplus of cactus. We got cactus growing. Looks like we just did a harvest, or we're in the middle of harvesting. We have a surplus of cactus. We have a surplus of wheat. We're making an extra large wheat farm. I'll probably make another, even more extra large wheat farm. We have... Oh, jeez. Well, I was going to say we have no upcoming events, but we have literally no upcoming events. Usually there's the schedule of taxation, and... Mm, that has me a little worried. Well, hey, I have always said... We are going to, uh, ride this save till the wheels pop off. I started this series on the channel without really thinking too much. This was the first thing I ever recorded for this channel. Literally made the channel just to play Kenshi. And I had a bunch of mods in, and one of the mods I had in was, um, the Genesis mod, which is, I think, is like a collection of a bunch of mods presented as one mod. And I uninstalled that and started recording. 
I did not reinstall a fresh, uh, install of the game. I didn't do anything. I basically just uninstalled a giant mod and then started recording with a bunch of other mods that may have had dependencies. Who knows? I don't know. That's kind of a no-no in general with modding. <laughs> um, uh, oh, are we about to get raided? I do believe we are. Ransacking town. All right. Uh, who is this? Sasabi, why don't you go open that? Hisamora, why don't you open that one? I don't want them destroying our walls. All right, and they're coming in. They'll start to ransack. We'll let them... We'll let them do what they gotta do. Oh, shit! What are you doing? Sasabi, you're better than that. Sasabi, you're getting the cra- Wait, where's your weapon? Why do you have no weapons? You're not an ex-slave. Sabi, why, why do you have zero weapons? Does anybody else have this problem? What the fudge is this? Where did you get a farmer's axe? What? Uh, Alright, so far it's just Sasabi. Alright, well... I've, I've lost my train of thought. I don't even know where I was, but... Like I said... <laughs> why don't you see if you can run past her and trade and get a uh, weapon? All right, everybody take care of that. Jeez Louise. Mmm, that has me very nervous. Let me just check these guys real quick. Everybody's got... I'm gonna look at shoes first. Everybody's got shoes on, right? Yeah. And everybody's got a weapon. I know the slaves lost their weapons, but... Mmm, I don't know. All right, everybody return to what you were doing. Oh my goodness. And let's, uh... Let's loot. Anybody got any, uh, bounties? Ooh, you do. You do. We still got some attacking happening. Oh, dogs! A dune dog is broken in. Hmm. Well, we need the meat, so. Oh! He's young, hit the floor. Guys, I know you can handle this. It's just a couple of dogs. Come on. Alright, we can no longer uh, just run sell stuff to our friends, unfortunately. Oh, what is this? Outlaw Farmers? You, you got a $1,000 bounty. Let's just make sure they don't come running in here. Well, we're not doing anything about it, so that's fine. Alright, my goodness. What a start. Alright, I don't even know where I was. Rudely interrupted by having our base ransacked. Alright, rudely interrupted. Lost my train of thought, but... Like I said, in the last episode, we were... We were ambushed, basically, by free traders. So I would like to head out there and at least scope out and see if it's still there. I mean, it also might not be there because I've imported the slave. It is what it is. Uh, and I would say slave hunters are just dead on sight from this point forward. I am done with them. I'm over it. They are dead. If we ever see them, they are getting killed. That's the deal. No matter where they are, no matter what they're doing, they're getting killed. But first, everybody needs to get healed. And I think what we'll do is, once everybody's healed, we'll, uh, head out this way. We're gonna... Waki, you're still carrying this guy, right? Yeah, you are. Alright, cool. Um, we're gonna take this person out to, uh, hang, I suppose. We wanted to go to hang anyway. We're gonna take them out to hang. We've got no upcoming events that really makes me nervous. Man, this whole thing is a mess right now. <laughs> we're gonna go to hang, see what's going on out there. We'll drop this guy in a cage and make 3,000 bucks. Welcome to slavery. That's not one of our people, right? All right, so that'll be the plan for today. I don't even know where I left off. This whole thing is a mess now. <laughs> oh, we're about ready to make a new wheat straw farm. Maybe let's do that. Let's set up another wheat farm. Done. Beautiful. Waki, don't you do it. Yeah, all right, cool. So yeah, my initial thought was the idea I was going to go see what the free trader uh, camp was doing, but I don't have the greatest confidence they're going to be there and everything's going to be okay. I'm also, like, incredibly nervous about this save right now, so I'm a little scatterbrained. Particularly worried that I don't see any upcoming events at all. None of the scheduled ones, like the taxation that should be arriving in a couple of days, but... Oh well. It's just going to have to be what it's going to be. As I said before, we're going to ride this uh, save till the wheels pop off. Alright, this is not half bad. We finally have extra chew sticks, we have extra meat, we're going to have an extra wheat farm in a second. Uh, I'm pretty sure I set Aquino. She's probably running back to do it. Yeah, maybe? No. 
She's still working on the farm. I think she's working on researching some cooking and things like that, so we can probably start looking at uh, other forms of cooking. Just kind of dilly-dallying here a bit. I want people to start getting back up before I leave the town. I'm not going to leave the town until operations is up and ready. Emmett, you're fine. He's young. I don't know how you got so badly hurt. I don't know what you could have possibly done to really <laughs> get yourself that hurt. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad that team finally has food. Jeez. That was a necessity. Okay, I think we are good enough to go. We're not gonna dilly-dally on this one. We've already dilly-dallied too much. Uh, we're gonna head straight out to about where the free traders were to begin with. Uh, the free traders do not hate us, really. They kind of, sort of don't like us. Um, but the first thing we're gonna do... We're gonna go straight to Hang first. Uh, cause we're gonna get rid of this guy and make some money. We're gonna go straight to Hang, we're gonna make some money, and on the way back we'll scout out the free traders. And, like I said, uh, from this point forward, if we see any slave hunters, they are dead. That's it. It's over. Uh, hopefully we don't get any, um... We- we could very possibly run into slave trading <laughs> problems going into Hang. We might leave a couple people outside and just run Waki inside on his own. How we doing out here? Oh, we used all our wheat straw. And all our cactus. Alright. Well, hey, it was a necessity. Because we now have chew sticks, and we got meat, and more chew sticks in there. Now, I feel like that... That camp was... Oh no, the camp was... Here. We still got a ways to go till we get to that camp. Alright, we are here. Oh, I feel like it was like, yeah, it was definitely, it was like right here. Yeah. Alright, they're gone. Hmm, whatever, they're on my shit list. Taxman visit. Mm hmm. I'm wondering if we're about to get screwed by extra visits now because I had to import the save. Mm hmm. <laughs> whatever. It is what it is. We'll deal with whatever comes. Um, but since we have no scheduled visits, I'm wondering if it just reset our schedule. Oh, I can talk to one of you. We need food. What happens if I give him 1500 bucks? I've only ever given him 50. Here, you can have 1500. You still say nothing. <laughs> oh, you become friendly. Oh, nice. Uh... How friendly? Friendly enough to stop attacking my base? No, barely. Alright, just you guys? Whatever, screw you guys. <laughs> we're gonna put Azagami... ...and everybody right here. And we're gonna run Waki inside by himself. Alright, Azagami and them will keep watch. And we'll go make 3,000 bucks, which we're gonna need now. Since we just gave somebody 1,500 bucks, and we're probably going to get visited by every single faction now. Howdy, sir. I have a bounty for you. Looks like you caught a bounty. Want a reward, I suppose? Take him. Thank you, sir. Okay. There is a fight happening. For some reason, they have left us alone. Slave hunters. Uh-oh. They're done for. Hey, I said attack unprovoked. Get down here. Did he die already? Priority got knocked out. Yes. Get him. Take them all down. Kill them all! <laughs> oh! Did we just get hit? No, I think he got hit. Alright, you jerks. Anybody got, uh... Bounties? Probably not, huh? Let's, uh, it looks like we're still fighting with somebody. No, we're good. Alright, let's all just chill for a second. Man, you guys have been committing crimes, but nobody's catching... Oh, a slave hunter got back up. Good. Very happy to attack you guys again. Just checking nobody's got any... Bounties. Oh, there we go. Waki. Grab him. We need 3,000 bucks. Taxman has arrived at Desert Campbell. How about not? Alright. Waki, get back inside. We're gonna need the money. So, head on in. Toshiki, you got- you got the helm. You got the con. Go talk to the taxman. Ow. Empire tax woman coming through! Man, I feel like I just paid taxes. Mmm. 
All right. Time to pay up this week's contribution, citizen. You should set up shop in the Empire land. You pay Empire taxes. The amount you need to pay is 3,000 cats. Yeah, I guess it got all reset. All right. Why should I pay taxes to the Empire? Because you've built your hideous little outpost on land belonging to the Empire, perhaps, hmm? You benefit from the trade routes and the protection of Empire guards, benefiting from the Empire services. Farming from the Earth of Empire land is, in essence, my boy, stealing from the Empire. All right, well, let's not go that far. So if you don't want to be treated as a thieving criminal, I suggest you pay your contributions to the Empire. A weekly payment of 3,000 cats, a meager amount for anybody worth more than a farm dog. All right. Good, I'll see you in a week for your next contribution. Uh, all right, so I guess we're about to get fucking rolled for a lot of money. Hmm, we're gonna get hit by the shinobi ninjas or whoever the ninjas were. Uh, all right, let's take the team back home. All right, let's go see what Operations is up to. You're making bolts, thank you very much. Where is Nakoka? You are standing around doing nothing, my friend. Are you still cooking meat? I mean, I'm happy about it. Yeah, you are. Wow. Nice. How are we doing on chew sticks? Very nice. Very, very nice. Who is this? Bell, are you just standing around doing nothing? How about you don't do that? <laughs> see how the scout team's doing. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. There's a lot going on right here. Let's see who this is. Outlaw Farmers. Outlaw Farmers. And Rebel Farmers. Man. Alright, let's give everybody a wide berth. I don't feel like dealing with this. Way too many people right here. Normally I wouldn't mind taking on some Outlaw Farmers, but... Well, why are we running? Why are we sprinting? Slave Hunters. Do we do it? I think we do it. Let's start with the back one. I don't know who was chasing after us. Oh, that could get a little ugly. Uh, there's a... Skimmer there. Oh shit, we're getting hurt. Why are these guys sometimes good? <laughs> Alright, one down. They're dropping. Good. Who is this? Who is this? Oh, you're just a slave hunter too? Alright, good. We'll take you. We'll take your gear, too. Very nice. Everybody attack this guy, come on. Man, this guy's holding up. And he's really not good. I mean, he's got good defense. Alright. Loot this slave hunter. Alright. Back home. Can everybody walk? Everybody good? Yeah, everybody's good. And one less group of slave hunters. Oh, somebody is moving into the base. Manhunters. Well, you better not raid. Alright, hopefully that manhunter walkthrough doesn't turn ugly, but... This is what the base is for. You're allowed to visit. Ah, you bastards. Alright. Did we come in just in time? Looks like. Let's see what happens. Let's see how it goes. A dead slave ain't worth nothing. Oh, it's a little bit much, but it looks like we might overwhelm them. We're doing really good. Got a couple people. Ah, oh, you're gonna you're gonna go down, aren't you? Oh no! Look at you coming back. Who are you, Mitsura? That's a lot of green. I love it. Yeah, I don't even know why you guys bothered trying. <laughs> we might take, um... Whatever bounty we... Strip from them and run that out to Stoat. Now that we don't have our... Uh... Resident Traders Guild, unfortunately. Let's go loot these Manhunters. Oh, who's got room? Alright, this does complicate things a bit, but I think it's more... Appropriate. Like, we had such a ridiculous easy time with, um, having a mobile money bag. <laughs> just like a resident money bag just sitting there for us. Alright. Well, 
Scout team, we gotta make money now. That's your job. Money makers. Okay, who is running out of the base as fast as they can? A manhunter. Can we get him before he gets out? Can we catch him? Seems like we might be able to. Oh, how somehow he got us? Somehow he whacked our leg from behind. This is what happens, manhunters. Don't forget it. Uh, they're starting to not like us. <laughs> Are you gonna run to- Oh, nice. Yes, good. One left. Wheat straw, 25. I love it. There we go. Azumi is getting attacked by somebody. Azumi, why are you outside the gates? And who is attacking you? What in the hell? Why is everybody outside? Everybody get in. Fight them in here. Toshiki, I can't have you fighting alone out there. I need you fighting in here. Alright, there we go. Oh, Toshiki, did you get really badly hurt? No. I guess this is what happens when you reset everything with an import. Man, stop failing that, that crop harvest there, friend. <laughs> Jesus, Teaspoon. Like, what? You? what's the point of you? You are constantly just getting trounced. And you're not even- oh, your defense is terrible. Teaspoon, how you doing? You're fine, everybody up. Alright. Everybody, get up. This could be a little dangerous. Uh, leaving them... Considering we've just had all this action, but... I think that it is time to go sell all this stuff. We need money. I think we head out to Stoat. Everybody up and at him. Everybody doing good? Good enough. Uh, let's do it. Let's head out to Stoat. We need the money. We got plenty of stuff to sell. We don't have our... our lovely resident... Traders Guild anymore. That all is what it is. That'll just have to do. Unfortunate as that is. And we are starting to sprint. Someone... is sprinting after us. A Sand Ninja. Yeah, you guys are very well outfitted. I have a feeling where we might not even get the opportunity to, uh... Oh! They're on their way. Maybe that's them. <laughs> nope, it isn't. Alright. Well, we're definitely gonna pay for protection from them. I don't need getting- I don't need to be getting attacked by someone who's... Level 34. Looking to trade? Show me what you got! Take all the stuff off of me, thank- 110% chance defense. Thank you, that's the kind of thing I'm looking for. You have no backpacks. I hate you. <laughs> oh, this is just what we needed. This is just what we needed. To liberate some idiots of their gear. Let's see if we can get back home. Hopefully there is no problem. Toshiki. The ninjas are near. They're right here. That is the San Ninja Chunin. Alright. Well, here we go. Howdy, friendly neighbor. Uh, howdy, your friendly neighborhood ninjas are here. Alright, well, let's go talk to you. There's only one of you. I literally could kill you, but... I don't like hanging around outside random outposts, so I'm gonna propose this quickly. The Oni has given you a generous offer, but like everything in these sands, it comes at a cost. Alright, what's the deal then? You pay us and we come help you fight when you need it, except the tax man. We don't fuck with the tax man, except for you don't. Alright, how much are we talking? A settlement of this, uh, stature would normally come to 4,000, but considering your friendship with the Shinobi, we can knock it down to two. Alright, that's fine. We'll be around if you're ever in trouble with some barbarians. See you in two weeks for the next payment. Alright, let's check up on the base. Valerie, how you doing? Are you cooking? We've got 53 wheat, that's fantastic. We have no cactus, because we've been making it like it's going out of style. Uh, we have learned some more... Oh, we need to know how to make bread. Hmm. Maybe, just maybe. Bread oven. What do you know? 
Uh, how do you make straw flour? Grain silo. You're fucking killing me. <laughs> oh my god, the amount of shit that fucking farming needs. Jesus Christ. Oh, and then I need wheat flour storage. Jesus Christ. <laughs> How are we going on straw flour? Did anybody make bread yet? <laughs> oh, looks like Valerie got close. Okay, extra large cactus farm. Three of them are going. Uh, we probably could build another extra large wheat farm. I'm a little obsessed with this farm right now. We're about to achieve bread. I'm gonna be so- oh, <laughs> we're so close. But, I think I goofed because I think we had neither the amount of wheat we needed for our farm, nor uh, the amount we needed for making bread. Oh well. Anything need to get done here? Uh, I'll tell you what we could do with Nakoka, since you're standing around doing nothing. But we could throw a bunch of Wakazashis in here. Because we could go sell those when the time comes. Oh, our iron capacity's full. Man, our everything capacity's full. Well, we're gonna have to make another- now that we don't have- man, that's what I was using the- <laughs> This is what I was using that Trader's Guild for, that is really unfortunate. They were great for selling excess stuff whenever it popped up. We may have to take a run with some of our newly made weapons and some of the excess uh, materials we have. I uh, suppose we could build some more storage. Alright, let's do that. Alright, I think that's where we're gonna leave it. Uh, we certainly have a lot of shopping in store for us in the next episode and probably beyond. Uh, but at least it seems like very soon we will be able to make better food than chew sticks. We'll be able to make dust witches. So we'll probably head out to some city in the next episode to pick up some more uh, wheat so we can lock in that farm and uh, sell some gear so we have some more money. But we'll do those things in the next episode, so subscribe for more Kenshi, and I'll see you next time.